Hi, I'm Spooky Nyman, and this is Tourist Trap. Tourist Trap is a brand new mentalism effect utilizing a classic principle. You hand your spectator a flyer for an open top bus tour, and they have a free choice of any popular tourist destination. Within seconds, you are able to reach into their mind and pluck out exactly where they've chosen. As if that wasn't enough, they then pick any train station they'd like, and again, you are able to work out where they've picked with 100% accuracy. Each set of tourist trap comes with one flyer for London and one for New York, so you are ready to perform at a moment's notice. Tourist trap is one of those gold mine tricks that you can chuck in your bag and perform anytime, anywhere. It is so much fun to perform, and to prove it, I'm bringing you a full performance shot on body cam. Thank you for letting me strap a camera to you. Absolutely. And I've got my camera here too. <laughs> uh, sort of a POV magic trick. Have you ever gone on holiday and gone on one of those like tourist open top bus tours? I did when I first came to the UK, yes. Good time? Yeah, great. I'm, I'm glad you had a good time. A little known fact about me is I used to work on one of those buses. Oh, Maybe really? not when you went on it, but I used to work on one of those buses. And uh, I developed a very, very cool ability by the end of my first day working there, which was as soon as someone got on the bus, yeah. I'd be able to work out where they were going to hop off immediately without asking them any questions. Pretty cool, right? Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah. Look, I'm going to demonstrate this on you if that's okay. Yeah, sure. Uh, so I grabbed this on the way, London Tourism Centre, and uh, it's like an open top bus tour, and inside it's got all these destinations okay. that you can uh, yeah, go. You've yeah. got entertainment ones, shopping ones, exploring ones. I'm going to give this to you, and uh, I want you to flick through those. I think it's just those three. And uh, choose one of those destinations. And remember it, but don't tell me, okay? okay. I'm, going to, uh, I'm going to look the other way. On your camera, you'll see me looking the other way. Happy? Yeah. Great. Uh, so we've got towards the back, I believe, yes, all the different routes that the bus can take. Mm -hmm. The only thing I need to work out with you, because you're quite a hard person to read, believe it or not, is whether it's a, uh, whether it's a popular destination or not. And that's going to kind of inform my decision. Okay. So uh, there's a couple of tours. Let's start with the first one, Route 1. Is your destination uh, in Route 1? No. No? No. What about Route 2? Yes. Uh, what's that, Route 3? No. What about Route 4? Yes. It is? Yeah. Okay. So, um, it's clearly a semi-popular destination. It's not like a, it's not like Leicester Square or something, but it's also not something really, really obscure. And it's... Um, can you try and think of it... Imagine not the destination in front of you, but, but the name of the destination in front of you. Mm -hmm. Is this... Is it one or two words you're thinking of? Two words. Yeah, I was gonna, it seems like there's kind of a bit more information. And it's a... Focus on the second word for me. The second word is not square, but it's a, it's, a, it's a description of a thing. It's a museum you want to visit, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. So, so, that, so it's going to be British Museum, something like that. Okay. You strike me as someone that maybe is uh, a little more kind of um, intellectual, a little more critical, maybe. So I think you're going to get off at the Science Museum. Am I right? <laughs> Leonie, what a pleasure. That was awesome. Thank you. So of course, well, look, look, let me try one more thing. Now, okay. now, now I'm in your mind. Aww. Let's see. I don't normally do this, but um, let's see if we can go one step deeper. Okay, so there we go. In the middle, we've got getting around. So we've got all these okay. tube stations. Um, take a look. And the stations are in black in bold there. Mm -hmm. And you've got the different venues that are kind of near each station. Choose one of the stations in bold and commit it to memory. But again, don't tell me. This is a little bit harder because they're obviously okay. a bit broader to work yeah. out. So memorize one of those don't tell me what it is um i'll actually i'll hold it open so i'm going to ask you a couple more questions about it so tell me when you've got one yeah, yeah. okay and then what i want you to do is um stick your finger in the middle of the page for me and i'm going to put mine on the back and we'll kind of connect like that Let's see if we can hold it open perfect yeah, okay your finger's not just on the tube station you're going to get off at, no. is it next no, perfect okay so I want you to, again, think of it as like a word. Think of it as kind of letters within that word. And I'm going to try and pick up. If it was like a big sign in front of you. Actually, because it's a tube station, imagine that you are standing in front. You've got the entrance. You're going to break it down into... I think there's an A. There's, there's, an, there's an A somewhere in it. I'm getting an A yeah, quite strong, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that an... There's something curved that feels like, is there an S in it somewhere? No, that's not. What about the lines that go through that station? If you just have a look, I won't look where you're looking, but see the, um, the tube lines that go through. Yeah. Uh, is there an, uh, is it the district line maybe that goes through? Is that where I'm getting the S from? Yeah, yeah, yeah right, yeah. okay. I think I know where you are. 
I think you're at Embankment, am I right? Yes, I am. I'm at Leone, thank you so much. What a pleasure. Thank Lovely you. to meet you. That was great. Thank you so much. Cool.